everybody, my name is Chris, and welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy 2. First and foremost, I have to apologize if the past few episodes have been even more subpar <laughs> than my other episodes I've been with my old mic. I had no idea the popping was that terrible, and that's definitely one thing I should definitely check and learn to check. Um, you know, like experiment and test before I record entire episodes. However, of course, I'm too derpy to do that. So screw that noise! Anyways, I've kind of fixed that by repositioning my mic so it's not directly in front of my face. Which I guess I should have not have been so stupid. I should have realized that would have just caused a popping disaster. And now it's off to the side. I also put a sock over it as a makeshift pop filter for now. You could probably still hear my pop pop poppings. Up. My mic's still probably popping from that. But, you know, fixing stuff and things. Hopefully in the next yes. few um, episodes, that'll, I'll have like a microphone stand and like a um, pop filter and all that all settled out. Hey bro, you're looking for a start around here, huh? You want me to take over for a while? I'm surprised how much I let you play as Luigi. It's like, they might as well just make him playable for the entire thing, right? I don't know. It's kind of ridiculous that they just put him at the beginning of the level when they should just make him playable in every level. That'd be fine! I mean, they did in Mario Galaxy 1. Why can't they do it here? Am I right? Am I right? Yeah, I'm totally right. Um, but yeah, so, I was actually looking for a mic stand, and I was about to order one, and they seem pretty cheap. I was like, okay, $30 for a mic stand, that's not too bad at all, let's order it. Shipping comes out to $150, and it's not like that for just one seller, it's, for, it's with that for like most sellers, I was like, holy crap. I, I don't know, I don't really ship, or I don't really buy stuff online too much, so I don't know if that's normal for what... To me, it kind of made sense because, like, I guess it's so big. Like the mic stands are, the mic stands are freaking big things. So I was like, okay, maybe that's why it's such a big shipping price. But is that normal? I don't know. I have no idea. Yeah, give me these, please, give me these. Ah! Yes. Oh, I barely even got that. So I don't know. Um, hopefully I'll have a new mic stand soon. I'm probably just gonna go out and buy one. Oh, what? The booze went to hit you as long as you don't look them in the eye. Okay. Tee did a boo Did a boo write that? It's a trap! <gasps> Look him in the eyes! <laughs> yeah. Okay, so actually, apparently boos are actually based off of... Uh, I want to say Miyamoto's... Wh what?! Those definitely won't walk across the bull, didn't they?! <sighs> well then, one... Oh, well, I was gonna say one moment, but there's really no point. I'll just freaking run there. Come on, Luigi. Oh, he's, he's so fast. Are you Usain Bolt? That's crazy, Luigi. You're so insane in the membrane. Yeah, apparently boos are actually based on, I think, Miyamoto's wife? Someone's wife in the Nintendo industry. Doesn't look like you walk across that. At least, like, not this part, but I mean, like, the part before that. Anyways, uh, apparently, I don't even remember the exact same story. All I remember is boos are based off <laughs> someone's wife. Yeah. Who knows? I don't understand either. Uh, what else was I gonna say? Crap, I- Oh, I'm having munchers! There was something- Ah! Holy crap! I totally felt like the carpet was moving, not this platform for a moment there. Uh -huh. We're just pretty much speedrunning this. Yeah, screw you, boo. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! See, now it's, now it's appropriate that I'm saying, oh, yeah, so much. Oh, you guys probably just heard that. That was my dryer for my work clothes. Alright! Okay, this freaking- Look at this! It's like, Luigi, you break everything- Hi! Ah! I said nothing. <laughs> of course, that would happen. Just as I said, Luigi breaks everything. Ah! Okay, I almost also died there. That would have not been a fun time for anybody, well, except for maybe. Is that? Is that... Oh, why did I get the feeling I just said something racist? Is that? Is that a bad word? I don't know. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> I think I've heard that word used in a negative connotation before. So I don't even know, I might even bleep that out just in case. WHAT?! I could not have landed any more worse! Ah. So I actually just bought a seat for my- Oh, actually I didn't buy a seat, that would have been ridiculous. Um, I want to go buy a suit. Don't you dare knock me off, I swear boo, I swear boo. I went to go look for suits for my grad. And in the window of a store it said, suits starting at $150. I was like, okay, that's not too bad. Go in there, ask them, how much do you guys sell suits for? $450 plus. I was like, uh, okay, how much? Don't you, Luigi! I was like, okay, how much do you rent suits for? 
we don't rent suits here. It's like, well, where, the, where did the $150 come from? Like, yeah, like in the window, it literally says the suit's starting at $150. It doesn't say sold at $150, it doesn't say rented at $150. It literally says suits for $150. So, it's like, where did that $150, like, it's like, what? What is this crazy people talking about? So, I ended up renting a tuxedo for $200. God, why do I suck so much at this game? I swear it's mostly me pressing A to jump, but like, I guess I press it not soon enough and it, like, it doesn't give the game enough time to register the fact that I just pressed it. And Luigi takes so long to stand back up! Oh, this was a terrible idea playing as Luigi, or maybe I just suck at this game. You know what it is? And I remember way, way back when I did my 100 subscriber special, I was, um, I was, when I was playing Super Mario Bros. 1, like, you know, for the NES. And then people are like, you know you'd probably be a lot better at this game if you actually just took out slower instead of trying to rush you everything. Which is true, but it's like, <laughs> who wants the beast? Who wants to take these games slow? Seriously, these games are so much fun. And when you try to rush through them, not really. But I mean, I always feel like I gotta rush through games now, which is weird because when I was a kid, I was a complete opposite. I would like, especially in the Golden Sun games, I would talk to like, and if you didn't know, Golden Sun was an RPG game. And whenever I get to a new town, I literally talk and mind read everybody in that town. Like, probably multiple times. I would try to go through every single text possible. And really, like, read everything and try to learn anything and everything about that game. And so when I was a kid, like, I would literally take games so freaking slow. What is this ghost stuff? Seriously, what is- I kind of want to go see what that is. Hey, but no, I'm all over the place. But at the same time, I don't really want to go- s I don't know if it- do these ghosts, do they only participate in the Luigi galaxies? As in the galaxies that plays Luigi? Who even knows? What? What you want, sucker? You've been through a lot lately, huh? Maybe you should just take a break for a little- This aggravates me! I hate it when games tell you to stop playing. It's like, really? <sighs> Man, this is so stupid. Isn't that the parent's job? I mean, seriously? To tell kids to stop playing games, not the freaking game itself. But game, seriously, what do you take me for? A freaking eight year old? I'm 18, okay? I'm 18, still playing Mario games. What has my life come to? Not that, well, not that there's anything wrong, but I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm hey, it's a para mystery box. I just tend to call everything that has wings in this game para. I don't know if that's a true thing or not. I do notice that seems to be the trend, though. Yes! Yeah. And if we go under here, this music reminds me of Animal Crossing for some reason. <gasps> it's a Star Buddy! You're trapped! Get out of there! This wish, this gift, give me the gift. So do you scared to leave my house, boy? What is? Oh man, that would be so boring to live on this tiny planet. Can't do anything. You have a freaking offering to the group of gods over here. So it's like what? You're freaking... You know, I, I destroy you! I destroy you and all you stack for! Yeah, destroy all the snow. Another one! Another Goomba Shrine! Oh, I could I should have destroyed that snowball so we could- HOW DID YOU GET HERE SO FAST?! What is this? Yes, of course, there is corpses! Maybe it's a different buddy. Didn't really think about that. So it's actually kind of hilarious. Is these trees? You could destroy them! Yeah, and then you get a snowball, it's like, ah, snowing stuff. Mm, I feel bad for people who, who never experienced a winter and can't build a giant snowball like this. Like, snowballs really do get that big. Like, you could literally make snowballs this big. I don't even understand why that snowball broke off. But, of course, at some point they stop being round and they start getting, like, all upside. Oh, God, like this. Snowballs start getting all lopsided, and then they suck to roll, and they're really freaking heavy, and then it's a possum brew. Well, 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 you just rolled into the domain of the chimp. You care about my gaming skills, right? Today, I got a little challenge for you. Just skate and bump the enemies. Watch out for the spiked ones. Simple enough, right? So you ready to experience this? Heck yeah, I'm ready to experience this! Let's go, man! I'm not scared of you! I ain't fighting no scrub! I'll give you this time you get 500 points or more. Good luck. Good fuck. So yeah, you're gonna wanna freaking get the green ones. 
Get the green ones. Get the green ones. Get the gold ones especially. Get the green ones and avoid the purple ones. I think you lose points if you touch them. I'm not going to experiment with that because I'm sure I'll accidentally hit one. Eventually. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. right. oh, nope, nope, we just got knocked, knocked back. Okay, that's not as bad. I thought you lost points. But, you know, this game is so easy. It's like, come on. Ah. So the day I'm recording... Oh, God, I'm freaking skating around everything. <coughs> the day I'm recording this... Oh, no, unless I get freaking... Millions of gold ones! <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, I'm perfect. I'm amazing at this game. Seriously, there's nobody better than me. <laughs> I mean, let's be serious. You got 540 points? I guess that qualifies you as my shining rival. I may not like it, but I promised. So you take this throw as a shining rival, as in I'm not the only one? What, you banana peel head? What is this? Does he also have a banana tail? He might have a banana tail. I kind of want to Oh, I'm not going to really see how my... He might have a banana tail. Oh, nope, he doesn't have a banana tail. He just has a normal tail. Anyways, without further ado, we gotta start! And now I'm not even that far into the episode. In fact, yeah. someone might even want to spar with me. Yeah. And my name ain't Jafar. Okay, I'm done with that. Um. Okay, I thought Comet Metal was gonna appear there. We haven't got the Comet Metal for this level, I kind of think of it. Oh, speaking of comets, a prankster comet has appeared. Alright, let's go do it. You know what? Let's not do it. Maybe I should do it so I only do. Holy crap! That was a secret star? I figured that was maybe the second star or something, but okay. I figured maybe I should start literally only doing prankster comments after I'm done a galaxy so it's a li little bit more organized, you know? You no, know, take breaks and go do a lot of comment medals, like, you know, only after I've completed the galaxy. What is this speedrunning? I am holy crap, I am the master speedrunner. Everyone must bow down to my might. Okay, not anymore. So, uh, we're actually looking for star chips here. I believe there's someone who tells us that. And I like this block because of how far down it goes. I mean, look at that. Ah, oh, give me that one up. Don't you dare. You will not. Don't flee, you fools. Don't flee, you fools. As Gandalf would say. Uh, oh, there you go. Okay. Uh, we are. Oh, maybe we're not. You know what? We're not, are we? We are not. Okay, I'm a liar. We are supposed to be looking for star bits in a different level. I am a stoop stoop. Alright, going back up here. We need. We're fly, fire, fire! I need your assistance. Can I not walk up here? Thank you. Thank you very much. Can I break this rock? It really looks like you could break that rock. Oh no, the the stem is guarded by two balls. Look, there's two balls and a stem. Okay. Ah, <sighs> they're lopsided balls too. <laughs> I'm saddened. What? Why am I making footsteps when I'm sliding in my butt? Oh my god, I'm breaking the game! And we destroy the Bowser statue, and if he actually waits, he totally, he doesn't, like, he just makes different faces, and it's hilarious, like, you destroy him. It's like, ha 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 ha, this game. He actually skid on the roof, which is fantastic, and I'm not missing a combo medal, am I? No, I'm not. Okay. Great. Definitely should have brought a fire flower here. Oh, never mind. I'm a freaking silly little pooper head. What's over here? Is there a one up here? There's totally one up here, isn't there? What? Why is that legend? Did I land there? I don't think so. Why is that legend like that? Is there something special? Is that something special? No. What is this? Ah! Am I about to f Well! See, am I about to find some secret? Nope, I am not. I'm just about to be stupid and kill myself. But that's okay because I get to go down the freaking fantastic slide again. Now, apparently. Oh, I almost jumped off there again. That would have been fairly embarrassing because I freaking suck at this game. Okay, you get out of here. Go home. Go home, icicle guy. You're drunk, especially because you just jumped off to your death. He's like, uh, there's no reason to live anymore. I totally feel like I could jump it back into that slide if I really wanted to. I'm totes my goat son. <gasps> I gotta kill myself. There's a comet medal there, I just realized, and totally forgot about, and I really want to get it. I mean, I really want to get it, because I don't want to redo this level, because I hate redoing levels, and only pro Let's Players 
don't redo levels. They always just stick with what they got. Gotta make your way to the top. Okay. Um, there is indeed a calm metal here. I knew that was too simple, especially because I revealed the pipe being right there. Um, I believe... Do these blocks fall? They do. That's kind of hilarious. They don't look like they would fall. They don't look like they'd fall. The rules of gravity! I was squished by snow! Uh, I was always terrified of being squished by snow as a kid, especially because uh, when I we would always build these. Well, actually, the snow clearings by like you know like the snow like that um, the bulldozers and stuff would always push snow to the sides of the streets, which would create these big snow mountains. So what we and friends would always do is we would like um, create we would create forts inside of these. And what I was always terrified of is because we build tunnels. Um, would we be, would be a, a tunnel collapsing on us? There's a the power metal. And it's not, not like I was like that was like a completely silly fear because it really wasn't. Because uh, I remember my parents telling me a story. I don't know if it was true or if it was just meant to scare me because they were worried about me. But I always remember hearing stories or, or a story rather of some kid who built. Um, yeah, who literally, uh, who built like a tunnel inside of a snow thing and then it collapsed on him. And then like he ended up dying, he ended up suffocating to death. It's like, that would suck, that'd be the worst way to go. So yeah, that sucks a lot. Um, this is really weird and definitely should not work, but... <laughs> yeah, you can freeze the lava. Who even knew? This actually goes pretty dang far as well. Even get on here and make the snowball big again. Yeah. I touch. What happens if I touch these guys with a freaking? They just die. Die. Oh nope. You're not gonna die. Okay. Um, oh boy. This is not gonna end well. And it did not end well. Nope. 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 That's not gonna work well either. Apparently. Uh huh. We're gonna grab you. And then we're gonna go back this way, and you are not gonna interfere with my evil plans, are you? Oh my god, there's way too many. And- OH WHAT?! Every time I think I can walk over something, it stabs me in the face like, ha ha ha, you're dumb. And then I die. That one was my fault, I definitely should have realized I could not walk over that. Over, it's like, from over- like, even from over here! There's barely even- there's like, that's barely even a step. Give me your snowball. Give it to me, baby. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Give me all your snow. Put you in the lava. In the lava. So, uh, there we go. There's an evil Bowser statue. Hmm, I wonder what could be inside of you, Bowser. Is there gonna be a pipe? Is there gonna be a launch star? Is there gonna be a star? Well, I am a star. I mean, let's be serious. Haha, <laughs> I'm such a freaking star. My mom says I am, so it must be true, right? Yeah. It's a star surprise! Supplies! What do you say when you give a co or office surprise on a special occasion? Supplies! Ah, okay. And without further ado, let's end off the episode there, shall we? So if you enjoyed this episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2, I would encourage you to please- Six minutes?! Good god, I suck at this game. I would highly encourage you to please, please, I'm begging you, I'll give you a million dollars if you leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. I and my name's Chris and I shall see you guys later. Peace! Uh, I got a stretch in between episodes, that's a terrible, terrible sign. I wasn't recording!